Hello everybody, it's Mel C back again. Just get back from vacation. I made one little stop I thought you guys might enjoy, so I shot some video. Um, I was at the Louisville Slugger Factory tour in uh, Louisville, Kentucky. If you're a baseball fan, I definitely recommend stopping in and checking it out. And uh, I got a few facts on the tour. You weren't allowed to take video or pictures of the tour itself. But I learned some cool facts. The first fact is that every ML, on average, the MLB player orders about 100 to 120 bats per year. That's pretty crazy. I had no idea they ordered that many bats every year. The second one is um, it used to take 30 minutes to carve a bat by hand. Now it takes about 30 seconds. So, and they make about 1.8 million bats a year. That includes the mini bats, uh, minor league, commemorative, and MLB bats. So they make a ton of bats every year. Um, about 65% of the MLB bats are maple, or about 32% are ash. And while you're on tour, they show you what who's uh, what player they're making, and they're making Josh Harrison of the Pittsburgh Pirates, and he actually orders some bats that are made out of birch, and only about three percent are made out of birch. So that was pretty interesting. Um, birch is, I guess, very similar to maple, but uh, the only difference is the sound of the ball hitting the bat. When it hits off a maple bat, you can and you hit a good hit, you can hear a pop in the good sound, a good pop. But the birch is more muffled. So it's hard to tell if you had a good hit or not um, by the sound of the bat. So the players like the maple the best. Um, so definitely a cool place to go. A um, couple things they give you at the under tour. These are the nub. There's a nub on each end of the bat after it's carved. And then they cut these off at the next stop. So they allow you to take a nub if you want. And then everybody gets a mini bat. It gets a little, little bit of slugger museum and factory bat so that's that that did shoot some video of the the main area and uh, they also have a Ripley's believe it or not uh, museum so I shot some video of that so I'll show you that now and uh, hope you guys enjoy